everybody. I got up at 5.30 this morning. I wanted you to spend the morning with me. I did my devotionals and I prayed. And I'll insert a picture of the devotional book that I use. Well, I use a few. But there's one that my husband got me. is a prayer journal, 52 weeks of prayer. And um, I like using it and I color in it. I use it at night also. So, yeah, we're up early this morning. And um, I usually get up early, but 5.30 is a little earlier. But I love it. I just love the mornings where I get up really early because you just get your day started, get your morning started, and you can pray and just have that alone time where everybody's in bed. So I am making breakfast, so come along and I hope you enjoy this video. And we'll go out in a few minutes. It's still dark, so I'm going to wait. And we'll go out and we'll watch the sunrise, okay? Still dark out. <laughs> Elijah's ready. He's like, it's time to go out. But it's kind of cold. It's nice though. Good morning, Elijah. Say good morning. Say good morning to everybody. Say good morning. Say good morning. <laughs> ahead and pour some salt on this porch because um, it is very slippery 
So let me go on ahead and get that done. And it's still dark out here. The sun is about to come out. You see, come up. So let's go on ahead and just enjoy, enjoy the music. And let me go on ahead and put salt on this porch because I think that's important. together. I'm going to go get my jacket because I'm cold. There we go. Okay, so the sun is beginning to rise. It looks absolutely beautiful. Look at the beautiful sky that God's given us. It's just gorgeous. Um, that's the one thing about this area. We get some beautiful sunsets and sunrises. It just looks really really nice I know it's kind of dark out here but I don't want to put on a ring light or anything like that because it'll take away from looking at the sunrise I like being up early getting the day started getting a good breakfast going I made some corn cakes this morning I usually mix pancake mix with some cornmeal and it's my husband loves it so I made some of that and um, just out here enjoying this beautiful morning and be going to work in a little bit. So I'm going to kind of bring you along throughout my day today. And um, I hope you enjoy and I hope you're enjoying this beautiful sunset. It's just absolutely gorgeous. We got so much to be thankful for to be out here and just watching the beautiful sky. Just beautiful. I like doing devotions in the morning. I like reading my Bible in the morning. And then sometimes I'll do a devotional book or I'll listen to a podcast or something like that. At night, I like to color in my devotional books. I just find it a lot of fun while I'm listening to something. Um, but sometimes we just need time to be quiet, you know? We just need time to sit and be alone with God. And sometimes the morning time is the best time to do that. We think we have to always have be entertained or something in front of us every day. But sometimes we just need to shut out the noise. Just listen for God's voice to speak to your heart. Yeah. So we have noises in the back. The background. You can already hear the trucks going and stuff like that, getting the morning started. Yeah. Hello. Good morning. Hi, what are you doing? Oh, early. Yeah. I've been I've been delivering oil for like almost two hours. Oh really? Wow. <laughs> well, that's nice to know. Yeah. Because I was scared to get here too early. Oh no, you're fine. <laughs> Just out here having my coffee, watching the sunset. Right. Yeah. This lake, uh -huh. four, two foot of water, four foot of mud. Oh wow. Oh, it's. Oh my. That's what I said when the first time I went in there. The water, you said the water is like this deep. Uh huh. But yeah, it's to here. And it's mud from the waist down. Oh my god. Oh, it's gross. <laughs> <laughs> I used to do it in waders and try to stay clean. Uh -huh. And now I, I put my wetsuit on so I keep it off me. Uh -huh. And then I just strip and spray my wetsuit off with the hose. Oh, it, it's, oh. Well, that's good. You gotta, you gotta figure out easy ways to do things. Yes, definitely. <laughs> There's always a way around things. Yeah, you know, like I said, I used to be in the water trying to hold my arms up because uh -huh. I didn't want to get it in the mud. And... Right. Sorry about the light. Oh, no, you're okay. That's fine. Okay, so I had a visit in the middle of filming. You know, what's the chances? The morning that I decide, let's film the sunrise. The guy that brings the oil for our furnace shows up. I thought that was funny, but that's a good thing because we needed the oil. We were almost out of oil and it gets very cold. You don't want to be out of oil. So that was a blessing. So now I'm going to go on ahead and we're going to work. I'm sorry you didn't get to see it rise completely, but we started, right? And it was pretty cool. So we'll try it again some other time. Here at work, just 
start our day. So I'm at work and the lady that I told you about that always leaves us eggs, she left us a dozen eggs. And here, these are from her chickens. And they're duck eggs also, my husband said. So these are the duck eggs right here. I've got to definitely wash them when I get them home. So I'm just gonna switch them from here because she likes to have her um, egg holders. What are these called again? Egg cartons. Egg cartons. <laughs> the egg carton, she likes to have these back. So I'm gonna put these into our egg carton that we have in the car. Put them in here. I love these eggs. It's so kind of her to bring us eggs all the time. lunch I am just having eggs I scrambled up two eggs with a little bit of milk and I put some of those cilantro leaves inside see if you can see it a little bit in there but anyway I put some of my cilantro herbs inside and I'm having this and I'm having a slice of toasted marble bread okay so I came back home from work and I came in I ate some lunch and then I changed my clothes and I just put on like a long sleeve white t-shirt with some other black leggings, my boots. I was going to wear a dress, but it started snowing now and I kind of want to be very comfortable. And I put on this nice fall sweater. It's just a very comfortable sweater that I bought at Walmart a long time ago. So now I'm going to go on ahead and I am going to head out. I am going to the Amish store, to the Ben and Dent and see what I can find on discount. Come to the Ben and Dent. They usually have free items in this cart right here. So let's see what they have. I don't think I can use any of this. I don't know what this is. This is like peptamin. I don't know. I don't think I, I don't need any of that. Yeah, sometimes they have other things in here, but um, I'm gonna go on ahead and I'm gonna head in 